Welcome, Indiana Congregations. My name is Matt Burke. I'm the Education Director for the Center for Congregations, and with me today is Dr. Colin Gray. Dr. Gray, thank you so much for being here. It's, it's a pleasure to be with you, Matt. Thank you for the invitation. Absolutely. Uh, Dr. Gray is the Dean of Students at Louisville Presbyterian Theological Seminary, and he's also the pastor of New Mount Zion Baptist Church in Shelbyville, Kentucky. And he's also the board president of New Mount Zion Community Development Corporation. And Dr. Gray is going to be presenting an event called Developing an Effective Community Ministry on Thursday, March 31st uh, at Progressive Baptist Church in Indianapolis. So yes. I'm very excited to have you come out and talk to us about community ministry. I'm looking very much forward to the opportunity so, to share uh, with the congregations. Yeah, so congregations, I think, are interested in uh, uh, community ministry, and, and why is it so important to think about and strategically plan how to develop your community ministry from your perspective? Well, congregations are still in the seat of urban life, and for all of the issues that are taking place in congregations, uh, it, congregations are situated perfectly to address all of the issues that uh, come about in community life. And so um, I think that it would uh, behoove congregations to look at what's happening in the community and then to come together as a ministry team to, to, de to develop solutions that impact the families that walk through the door. With us encouraging people to worship and to be focused on the things that makes for good discipleship, it is it's important for congregations to pay attention to those areas of life that could impact their uh, congregants ability to be able to be a uh, focus for worship. This presents for congregations a wonderful opportunity to be part of the solution. And while we're praying and while we're believing God to do great things, we can be a part of what God has created us to do. And that is to be a witness to the congregation, the presence in the community, so that we can uh, change things for the better. Mm. So it sounds like you're saying that congregations are uniquely suited for this kind of work, being in Absolutely. geography and location, uh, to be able to listen to the community and then begin to assess the needs, but then also address the needs that are happening around them to strengthen not only the congregation, but the community as well. Absolutely. All right. Well, what can, uh, what can participants or attendees hope to take away from the event? They can look forward to going away with strategies. We're going to plan to have working sessions during, that, uh, during our class so that the teams that come together will come away with a beginning of a roadmap for their particular congregation. So first of all, the first session will be to help them to look at where they are, the community that they, the church resides in, and to dream about what is it that they care about the most and how to begin to start lining those out and to make a selection as to which one of these issues we're going to address. And then they can look forward to having various ways that they can address that. And their working part will be to decide how they're going to go about doing that. And I'm going to have all kinds of examples and a process a planning process that they can utilize that will be able to address this and any other issue that they may address in their communities. All right. So it sounds like there'll be some very nice practical application things they'll be able to take away and implement uh, in their own specific locations and geographies on the other side of the event. Absolutely. They're going to learn about the power of whiteboard ministry. All right. Well, we're very excited to have you come out, Dr. Gray. So once again, that's going to be on Thursday, March 31st from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m., at Progressive Baptist Church in Indianapolis. So, yes. uh, Dr. Gray, thanks again for your time, and uh, we hope to Thank see you. Thank you so much. Thank you for the privilege. Absolutely. Bye-bye.